What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy more content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for all signs, cups, and sides, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Fluid. Excuse me. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. For real, for real, for real. From the bottom of my heart chakra. We're 13,160 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 5 The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. Uh, if you feel guided to donate, please don't donate and then request the money back. Just saying, just saying. Okay, so I received another channeling, so we're going to do it. Hope everybody's doing well. My kitty's home. My kitty's home. I made a special video for it because it's just so awesome. But my kitty's home. He came home by himself this morning. So he's home. Just lay right now. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, several home tarot card readers um, are about to experience huge payoffs in their life. Several of their clients are about to request um, refunds back. For readings and um and i heard at the end of that it was about 30 seconds or 45 seconds after that i heard and several online popular public platform readers it's about to piss them off in a huge way so you plug it in how it resonates however that resonates and applies um in one's life now i feel you could be the home there's a reason i'm pulling this in so you could be, by the way, these are psychic intuitive messages. So one message may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your situation story, not anybody else. Do you plug it in how it resonates? Just saying. So I feel, or you just might like listening to stories, how that resonates, okay? Um, you, you plug yourself in where you fit, okay? If you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share my channel. Um, love and appreciate all the support. Single mom and two kids. So it helps support a single mom and two kids in one of her income streams. So just saying, just saying. Um, okay, so yeah, so several home tarot card readers are about to, it sounds like you could be the home tarot card reader or you could be the person about to request the refund back from the home tarot card reader. There's two situations in here. There's home tarot card readers about to get um, all these requests. It sounds like many of them from previous clients or current clients requesting refund money back from readings. You could be the home tarot card reader. They're about to request these home refunds back, back. Or you could be the person requesting the refund or refunds back from the home tarot card reader. That's situation one. Situation two, I heard there's also social media, online popular social media platform people um, about to get request refunds back too. So you could be the online popular social media platform person or people on the platform about to get requests back for refunds of readings, past, I heard past readings, or you could be the person about to request the refund back for the reading of the past. However that resonates and applies in one's life, I'm pulling this in for a reason. So I feel whoever this is for, I feel at least one of you guys fits in one of these categories is what I'm trying to say. So you plug it in how it resonates. It's some kind of readings of the past. Very, very, very inaccurate. Was lied to in a huge way. Very, very, very inaccurate. Was lied to in a huge way is what I heard. So some kind of inaccurate readings. Um, lied to in a huge way in some shape or fashion. You plug it in how it resonates. So some kind of inaccurate readings in some shape or fashion. And somebody was lied to. So um, I feel that's these people. If this is you, um, you plug it in how it resonates, but some home tarot card readers, some online platform people, popular online platform people. I feel these could be masculine or femme, masculine or femme, masculine or femme, masculine or femme. You plug it in how it resonates. There were huge lies here. Some of these are regarding a, uh, a legal business of the past of a family. 
There are huge lies here, and some of these are regarding um, an illegal business of the past regarding a family. So there were huge lies here in these readings, and um, they're past readings. They're past readings, and some kind of um, some of them are regarding some kind of illegal business of the past regarding a family. So it sounds a little secret seventy if you ask me, but. I don't know. I didn't hear that. But you plug it in how it resonates. Experiments it is you have reflected. Her take it. We have envy upright. Number 20 could be very significant. Number one is life. Number 20. Some of these readers were privately asked to pull energy on a feminine energy that had an illegal camera in her house in the past. They were obsessed with her. They wanted to know her energetic space. They lied. They lied in a huge way. And these people know this now. Oh, my Lord. You plug it in how it resonates. So some of the so the home readers or the um, online public platform people, um, these people came to these people. Basically, there was an illegal voyeur camera. It sounds like placed in a fem energy's home in the past. Um, it could be you, the camera, illegal voyeur camera was placed in in the home in the past, or somebody else. How does that resonate? But. It was placed in the home, then it sounds like it was disabled or taken out or what have you, what have you. So, but these people that went to the people for the readings, paid readings, they were obsessed with this feminine energy. So when it got disabled or taken out of her home, they were obsessed with her and they wanted to pull her energetic space. So they hired these people to do it. But these people lied. They lied on her and the situation. But now, these people know it. They know it. So these people were jealous of her or her energy or something. They lied on her energy, her energetic space, etc., etc., etc. So they lied. They intentionally lied. But now, these people know. They know that they lied. And now they want their money back. They want their money back. God is the moon reversed. These people are not true. They're not what they say they are. Um, basically, they're frauds. They lie. They intentionally lie. They intentionally lie on the energetic space, or maybe for some they didn't. I heard they intentionally lied. They intentionally lied. I was gonna say for some maybe they didn't know how to read cards or lied about their abilities. Some some did lie about their abilities. Absolutely. Some did lie about their abilities. Absolutely. So some intentionally lied, and some did lie about their abilities. So maybe for some, they truly can't read the cards or they say they have some kind of clear audience, clairvoyant or, um, or the smell ability or the dreamscape or what have you, what have you. And they really don't, um, for some, um, but however that resonates, whether they truly just don't know how to read the cards or read the energy or read what have you, what have you, or lying about gifts or what have you, they lie, some intentionally lied on this femme energy they were asking about that had this camera in her home. Um, they lied on them intentionally and some, they lied about their abilities. So you plug it in how it resonates, but how that resonates? These people are waking up or they already have woke up and they're about to request the money back. Yikes. So not true goddess of the moon energies. They're not truly, um, highly intuitive, keeper of the secrets, um, all knowing, um, I feel for some, they just truly don't know how to read the cards or read the energy or or what have you, what have you, if they're just reading cards. Now, for some, they could say they claim they have blah, 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 ability, blah, 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 ability, and blah, 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 ability, and they really don't. I've been pulling in um, fake psychic home people I'll, very heavy in here recently. So for some, it could be fake psychic people and that runs businesses out of their home for some of them. Goddess of the moon reverse. They're not true high priestesses, basically. Or high priest. However, that resonates. 
Wow. And magician in the mirror reverse. So, yeah. They manifested all this money in off this feminine energy that had a, hit a camera in her house in the past. But now, soon, it's about to energetically boomerang back on them. And they're about to have to give the money back. Or get into a lawsuit, I'm presuming, if they don't give the money back. Um, because they lied. How that resonates. Magician in the mirror reversed. Um, no manifestation here anymore because they're about to have to give the money back. Wow, man. You plug it in, how it resonates. Patience. I think these people have been patient and now they're about to um, request the money back. I feel for some, you could be in this situation. I feel for a lot of you guys, actually, if this resonates for you, you're over here in this category. But these people did it because they were jealous. Whether they have an online popular social media platform or they um, have a home business. All that resonates. They have a home. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. But I feel they were jealous. I'll tell you that. I heard in here earlier they were. I heard in here earlier they were. Yeah, they were jealous. All right. Number 16, 20, 53, or 52 could be a very significant number. 16, 20, 52, or 53. These dirty magicians are about to experience very heavy negative karma. These people are about to stand up to them in a huge way. These dirty magicians are about to experience huge negative karma. These people are about to stand up to them in a huge way. So dirty magician energy. This is dirty magician energy with, well, the goddess of the moon reverse coupled with magician in their reverse is dirty magician energy all day long. They claim they're one thing they're not. And um, they manifested with lies and manipulation. Now it's about to energetically boomerang back on their ass, basically. Dirty magician energy. Boom. Boom. Oh, they were jealous. Wow. Let me see if I hear anything else. Some of these readers are about to get in, um, heavy involvement with the law. Very heavy involvement with the law. They are about to be pissed. Oh my God. I heard some of these readers are about to get in heavy involvement with the law. They're about to be pissed. Dear God Almighty. You plug it in how it resonates. I'm a full of kippers. So some kind of heavy involvement with the law. They're about to be pissed. Spirit messages you have reflective. But they shouldn't have lied. And the thing is, is that they knew about a hidden camera in somebody's house in the past. They should have called to get some help to get the hidden camera out. Not just pull the energetic space on this poor femme energy. They knew she had a hidden camera in her house. But yet they knew they were going to make money off of her through all these readings. What they should have done is call the feds or call the police or, call, or contacted her and say, hey, you've got a hidden camera in your house. And I'm just being for real. The people I need to hear that. I heard some of them are about to get in involved with the heavy involvement with the law soon. They're not going to like it. So it's going to be negative involvement with the law. I think it might be regarding this or regarding something else. You plug it in, how it resonates. Number 37 or 39 could be a very significant number of one's life. 37 or 39, we have poverty and community upright. Took these people's money under false pretenses, but these people were about to stand up in a huge way. Oh my God, I heard took these people's money under false pretenses, but they're about to stand up in a huge way. So these readers, 
free willingly took these people's money knowing this poor chick had a hidden camera in her house. Knowing they wanted to know on her. They, they were feeding their addictions, basically. When they could have called the law and had the, 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 or somebody or, or contacted her and told her, hey, you've got a hidden camera in your house. Please get your hidden, uh, here's where the hidden camera is. Please get it out. But no, they chose to make money off of it. How dirty is that? Um, but I heard these people are about to stand up in a huge way. So I feel for some of you might be these people in this group, possibly. You're about to stand up in a huge way. Request your money back. And for some of these people, I heard they're about to get in heavy legal issues with the law soon. So I think like police. Um, so poverty and community, they put their community in poverty, free willingly accepting all this money for um, readings on a chick that had a hidden camera in her house to feed their addictions because they were so obsessed with her and they knew they were. They knew these people were. So they probably, they made a hefty, good bid off of them. So they put their community that came to them for home services or online behind the scenes personal readings in poverty. I feel they probably charged a good amount of money for these readings. All because they knew they were feeding the addiction. Which was this chickadoo had this hidden camera in her home to begin with and they couldn't bore you in on her anymore and they wanted to pull her energy. Whoa! How dear God! <laughs> so community in poverty. But soon the roles are about to reverse with the request of refunds. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of requests of refunds are about to come very, very, very soon. And quickly. A lot, a lot, a lot of requests of refunds are about to come soon and quickly. So a lot of requests of refunds are about to come soon and quickly. Boom. It's about to energetically boomerang back on their ass. Well, that was a hot mess express to begin with. They should have done the right thing. Well, and these people could have done the right thing too. Somebody could have called the police or the feds and got that woman some help. Many, 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 many shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this situation soon. Many. One of these readers are about to be so mortified. So mortified. Okay, I heard basically a crap ton of shocking series of chain events are about to occur with this situation, these situations soon. And, um... I think that's all these requests. It sounds like a shit ton of requests are about to come back. A shit ton, a shit ton, a shit ton, like a shit ton. And one of these readers are about to be severely mortified soon. So, I mean, very embarrassed over something. Uh, maybe it's because they're about to get all these requests back for all these refunds, possibly. I don't know if it's the home reader, the online popular social media platform, or maybe, maybe one of both, maybe for some. I don't know. All right, you guys, we're done. I'm getting out of this. Love you guys. Namaste.